when you have a guest coming over and you have not cleaned up anything in your apartment since you got home. <laughs> It is the 27th of December. Holy crap, it's almost over. The year's almost over. That's ridiculous. I just got back to California. I'm so excited to be back. Um, I got in super late last night. I got in at like 1.15 or so from the airport. The bags took forever. The taxis took forever. I ended up getting home at like 2.30. Bed by 3 p.m. 3 a.m. <laughs> 3 a.m. And now I'm finally back. I woke up super early. I got some work done. I um, started editing a video. Anyways, regardless, Back to the grind today I have a lot of stuff to do today but we have a special guest coming in town today and I'm really excited um, I'll show you guys who he is in just a second but first I have to go clean up this thing because he's coming here and like it's it's a disaster all right guys our special guest today introduce yourself Hello, my friend my name is Chase Tuning Tuning the Elder. Tuning the Elder, yeah. Amanda's <laughs> taking me here to uh, Gold Sham Venice Beach. Chase is here with his wife's family. They're here for like the week just vacationing, but we're also getting some work in because Chase has a podcast and we're gonna interview later today and we're also gonna do lifting, YouTube collabing, all the things. So it's kind of work, kind of fun. All right, so we have some heavy deadlifts today. I'm so, so excited. My coach is having me go to doubles instead of triples really quickly. Going up in rate weight pretty high for that, so like I'll show you guys what I'm doing. I'm kinda nervous, see how it goes. I'm gonna warm up properly. It's taking me like 15, 20, 30 minutes to just warm up. I'm doing some glute bridges with the hip circle, I'm doing some lunges, a little bit of stretching, a little bit of mobility work, dynamic stretching, getting to that and then getting to some deadlifts. And Chase is doing some squats, so we're sharing the platform today. My working sets, a couple of them I missed just because my camera has 9% battery and I want to get to the important stuff, which is the working sets. We're doing 225 today for five sets of two. And I kind of made the jump pretty quick. My coach has had me do doubles this week because we're retesting this weekend. I'm excited about it. So things are going kind of slow, but we're going to get them all finished. Mark my words. <laughs> 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 There you go. That's heavy. Lightweight, lightweight. Okay. Lightweight, lightweight. Yeah. You did it. Not that bad, it's just slow. Slow control, we're good. do not hook up to my laptop, I use this Thunderbolt instead of USB, so lucky for me, I'm interviewing someone who actually is doing a similar thing. So, and the Bucci, stay tuned for the broadcast on Everford Radio coming soon, and I will actually be coming back to be the interviewee for Bucci Radio, uh, probably in a few days, I don't know, I think we're gonna get back together. Maybe to Friday afternoon. Yeah, we're, I think we're gonna go lift at Barbell Brigade, and uh, I'll see her again soon. Barbell Brigade, yeah. represent. It's been, uh, it's been a blast. Hang all right, we just wrapped up my interview, which will be on Ever Forward Radio. We're not setting a date yet, but just yeah, stay no tuned. Dates. No yeah. dates. Not to shoot ourselves in the foot. My right. podcast will be coming out similar time to Chase's podcast. So she's just caught podcast me. buddies. I'm not. God, get your own life. It's like when people started making YouTube channels, and everyone's like, "I started a YouTube channel first. Yeah, I pretty much invented YouTube. I mean, and podcast. And podcast. I am Queen's Bull. And pretty cool. I, I did actually invent pretty cool. 
People give max credit for that. That's mine. I watched a video it's when I was perfect. doing my research, and you were like, "That was me." It's me. It's all me. Or I, Max I said that. <laughs> Pretty cool. So um, he has to head out, so we're gonna reconvene yeah. at another part of this week. He's gonna be here for the week, so get the interview in. Catch you guys in the next clip. Stay boochy. Thanks for coming, Chase. Good lift. I'm taking this mug, by the way. It's Karen's mug. Mine. <laughs> you guys don't know how happy the fact that this is able to render makes me feel. <laughs> So Chase just left and I immediately got on my computer because I was supposed to upload a video this morning But I had to re-edit the entire video because like with the new camera Not having a new memory card and having to be doing daily uploads for a few days in a row Traveling and stuff like I haven't been able to like clear up my computer and give my computer the best Efficiency I suppose so every time I like am filming stuff like my memory card anyway It doesn't really matter. I had to re-edit the entire video so putting that up now and then I have a lot of other stuff to do and then I, I didn't want to tell Chase this because he was getting a migraine during the workout but I actually have to go back to the gym tonight and finish my workout because my coach is having me do sets of doubles for everything today so I have to go do squat and bench press later today it's 5:17 right now I'll probably go around 7 or so because I have some other stuff to get done um, with my website I'll show you guys the email in a second but I'm going to upload this video super quick I'll show you what else I'm doing so you can see what I do for my job. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm taking a quick break from work because I have a friend, another friend here Did today. You say friend? Friend? What? Friend? Like yes, I'm your friend. Yes. <laughs> I was like, wait, what? Come on, go with it. People ask if Emily and I are still friends all the time. You haven't been in my videos in like oh, not that long. I don't know. We just like hang out when we can and catch up. And like she just came over to catch up and say hi. And like she got in at 3 a.m. last night and <laughs> she was busy all day long. I was busy all day, so I walked over to come say hey. There's plenty of times when she walks over and says hi to me and we're not like, oh my god, let's vlog and Snapchat this. <laughs> like, yeah. Instagram it, but we will Instagram soon, I'm sure. At some point. Yeah, maybe New Year's. <laughs> yeah, New Year's! Yeah, we will for sure. Are we doing anything fun for New Year's? We may go to a house party. Oh my god. Get crazy. Y'all are on prep. Wine. Yeah. Prep people. I'm not. I might have a glass of wine. <laughs> I fit it in my macros. Fit it or in. a few. Mine's easy. Yeah. Yeah. Hey guys, it is 8.36 p.m. I am just finishing up some emails. Just sent over my guy about my website information, so I had to pick colors and stuff. Coming up with all of this is like a lot of work. Like I'm trying to create a lot of content for you guys so I can have um, a blog on my website. And I have a bunch of content information that I've learned over the years and shared with you guys And I thought I was gonna have to like come up with a list of topics and like rewrite everything But I realized that I've been creating content on Instagram in my captions for three years So if you're one of the people that reads my Instagram captions I just realized that like I've, I've written a lot of the stuff and a lot of people who might be new to following me Might have missed some of that in the, over the years or like not everybody reads every single caption Just trying to get caught up in life guys here and just organizing my YouTube footage organizing some other things going on, the podcast information, I'm scheduling out some interviews for the rest of the year, um, the LA Fit Expo is coming up, so I'm just gonna keep rambling on like the things that I have to do, but it's a lot and I'm excited about it, but I have to like sit down and, and do a lot of thinking. Um, it's 8.39 right now, I have to head to the gym and finish my workout. I can't even talk right now. I should just be a meathead and just not talk and go to the gym. You would think that the gym parking lots wouldn't be that packed on a Whatever night it is, Tuesday night at 9 p.m. Let's get inside. Hi right, guys, we're back at the gym. The reason why we are back here right now is because um, I'm getting really close to my meet, right? So I'm about four and a half, five weeks away from the meet. And my coach wants me to retest my maxes before the meet just so I can see where I really am. So we can make an accurate guess as to what my attempt will be for meet day. So I can really hone in on like what I can actually do right now. So we're gonna be retesting my max lifts. You'll see in the next work at workout video, which will be on Friday at Barbell Brigade. Um, so we're gonna be retesting like one rep maxes, or just testing them all in general. I haven't tested a one rep max since last April. He wants me to do sets of doubles, aka sets of two, for heavier sets, closer to my one rep max, 
just to get my body acclimated for Friday. Something, just freaking do it and don't make excuses. I know it's easy for me to say, right? Because I don't do anything else all day. I'm a YouTuber. Get to the gym if you can, guys. If you have a job where you have to get to the gym at 5 a.m., get to the gym at 5 a.m. If you commit to something, just don't make excuses for yourself. There's plenty of excuses you can make one other person, the person next to you can make for themselves to not do the things that are gonna bring you closer to closer to your goals, closer to making you happy. All of those excuses, that's resistance pushing back at you. Um, every single day we wake up and we have resistance pushing back at us. It's a daily battle. The second that we have the snooze button and we press that, you lost the first battle of the day. So every time you say no to going to the gym, you're letting resistance win. Don't let it win. Finish your shit and get it done. I just, I, I don't have an explanation. Aside from the stevia issue, I swear to God, I'm all there. <laughs> I'm just checking my email. It's the morning now. I went to bed. I didn't finish edit, um, didn't finish filming um, for this video yet, but I am going to do that now. But I'm just checking my email and someone named Rachel Labit, L-A-B-I-T, she sent me an Amazon gift card because she appreciates my YouTube videos. Like, I'm, I just had to say thank you because no email. I can respond back to you and say thank you. So, Rachel, if you're watching this, thank you. I truly appreciate that. That's okay. <laughs> Why did your music start popping up when I was recording? Okay, guys, here's a little bit of what I'm taking this morning. So I haven't been taking this because I've been traveling and I keep forgetting, but Genoflex, like I've, I'm starting to feel it. That's why I'm like de deciding to take it today. Um, it's a joint supplement and it is four capsules per serving. So I'm taking that, it's from PE Science. Also taking this, it's a cognitive aid. Um, it's like a nootropic, very highly underrated. Like I actually really enjoy this product, but I don't remember to take it enough. And I'm also taking Organine. So this is um, nine essential ingredients. It's like a staple ingredient uh, pro uh, supplement because it has a bunch of ingredients that you would normally take separately all in one. So it has like your um, creatine serving in it. That's like the main reason that I take it. It has my full daily serving of creatine in here. So I just mix it with some ice and a straw. Okay, guys, here's a little bit of what I'm taking this morning. So I haven't been taking this because I've been traveling and I keep forgetting, but Genoflex, like I've, I'm starting to feel it. That's why I'm like deciding to take it today. Um, it's a joint supplement and it is four 
capsules per serving, so I'm taking that. It's from PE Science. Also taking this, it's a cognitive aid. Um, it's like a nootropic, and it's one of the most highly studied products um, from PE Science, and it's, it's very highly underrated. Like, I actually really enjoy this product, but I don't remember to take it enough. And I'm also taking Organine. So this is um, nine essential ingredients. It's like a staple ingredient uh, pro uh supplement because it has a bunch of ingredients that you would normally take separately all in one so it has like your um, creatine serving in it that's like the main reason that I take it it has my full daily serving of creatine in here so I just mix it with some ice and a straw got my B Pardomas calendar in the mail got some stuff mapped out for January and then February kind of got some stuff mapped out and there's Emily, that sick picture. There's Karen. And there's me, Miss July. I like love this picture so much. It's just like really bright and fun and my birthday month. If you guys didn't know, this is my birthday. If y'all didn't know. That's it. You guys can get these on pardomasathletes.com if you're getting a calendar for 2017. They're still available, so check that out there. YouTube life on my tripod. I talked to my coach and we're just taking that for what it is. My body's just been getting acclimated to the heavy weights. Heavy weights. I'm like five weeks after my competition, I think maybe even four or something like that. Maybe four. <laughs> um, four, it's four. Focusing on adding the higher intensity, more heavy weights to my training now. So I'm just gonna take that for what it is. For all of the accumulated reasons, it just didn't really work out that night. So we took a step back. I did some light training today. I have an off day tomorrow. I'm gonna show you guys what I do to prepare to test for my one rep maxes tomorrow. Yay, I'm gonna be testing. It hasn't been, it's been a while since I've tested my, my one rep max, probably since last April before I broke my wrist when I was in the middle of my bikini prep. So it's been about six or seven months since I've tested. So I'm excited to see where I'm at. And I'm gonna end the, go ahead and end the video here and I'll catch you guys in the next one. If you guys haven't subscribed to Chase's channel yet, his link is in the description box. So go click on it and go subscribe to him. He has great videos, um, very well spoken. And he has his podcast coming out that my interview is going to be on. Podcast is coming out on January 22nd. I'm not sure when my interview will be out, but uh, I'll let you guys know and I'll catch you in the next video.